Well, hello, Viva MK. Thank you for joining me on this, what has now become customary, a live Viva MK update direct from HQ on this occasion. And as you can notice, we still haven't managed to clean up behind me here. So, um, firstly, it's really great to have these live updates. I don't know how I got um, strung into doing them, but um, you know, feedback suggests that it's always a good idea to do so. Always share the updates because I'll always try and update you on the latest information from the business. Um, later on today, almost soon after this live update, I will also send you another email communication. Do keep checking your emails all of the time because I really wanted to, like I said to you on Monday, really increase the level of information that we're sending you. You know, in these still inception weeks of the business, there is always so much going on, so much going on in the business, things changing at a heady pace every single day. So do keep checking because I'll try and up the level of communication. You know, like I've always said, if you are partners in our business, which I truly believe you are, and it's truly, you know, the concept I really want to work on, that we're all partners in this business together, then I need to get more and more communication out to you. So we have communication that goes out to you personally on email, and of course, through social media. And we try and increase that this week. So every day I've communicated something to you. And you may have noticed the immense amount of recognition that we sent out the other day. You know, hundreds and hundreds of people have achieved something at a certain level in the business already. And in my humble opinion, I have to say it's probably the greatest amount of recognition that I've seen in one single month of business in any organization ever. So thank you to every single one of you who have played a part in that, who have been recognized, who have achieved something, that have done anything in the business so far. It is so, so utterly important that you are recognized for that. So thank you to every single person. You all make part of the Viva MK organization. And as I keep saying, it's such an inception stage in the business. Everything that happens is so important. So the communication, I'm going to keep it up every day as much as possible. So you always know what's going on in the organization. And of course, and then it avoids the hundreds of emails coming in of people asking really basic things sometimes that are, you know, that, that can easily be answered through Q&As and things. And talking about information, an update from last week, I remember I mentioned CBD oil and the amount of feedback we got both um, online, sorry, on, on social media and personally has been phenomenal. So I haven't made any decisions on that, um, but I just let you know that I appreciate your feedback and I've got both sides of the argument. I still believe it was an important subject to bring up. It's not often I would ask for your opinions generally on a product we're about to bring out, but I thought that one, I really had to. And I appreciate both sides of the argument. So watch this space. Thank you for all your feedback on the unicorn horns. And for those that told me what I can do with them. So appreciate that. Appreciate all your feedback as always. Two things I'm still working on, and I'll be straightforward and honest with you because I said that I'll always be transparent. One is the bedding flyer. It should have been two weeks ago. That's now scheduled for Monday and the personalized catalog and offering. Now, I'll give you the reason why they're delayed. Not just because I'm slow because we don't get things done or something goes wrong, but I don't ever want to release something that has limited stock availability. Not the number of products, but the number, the amount of stock. You know, if I release something, if we release something from Viva MK, I'd like to think that majoritively the products are in stock. Well, with the bedding flight and with the personalized, we were just having some trouble actually cornering the amount of products. The last thing I want to do is to give you a brand new flyer or a brand new catalog or anything like that that has limited availability is nothing more frustrating for your customers for you and of course the organization so 
Personalized, I'll bring you more information, hopefully um, in a Q&A soon, so you know exactly what's going on with some dates. Bedding flyer is looking like that is coming in on Monday. Again, I'll let you know more about that as to how many you'll be getting. I think I've mentioned that before, but I'll clarify it again. How many you're getting, what the items on there are, and anything else around that. Um, and as you know, like I've always said, this year I wanted to keep everything in the business to a very minimal cost. I want to keep everybody's overhead low not just your overheads but our overheads here because if we keep our overheads low we pass the savings on to you and if your overheads are low that can only mean one thing that you make more money because listen at the end of the day as much as it's great to have this camaraderie and this connection and this spirit we all joined to actually make an income so the more income we can help you make by reducing overheads the better and that's really the aim certainly in 2018 and you know and of course going forward um i told you that i'd give you a date for our um viva mk new beginnings showcase which will be early next year and we'll have plenty to recognize plenty of training plenty of the usual shenanigans um and I know sometimes when I give you dates and ideas and products, then things change, but I tentatively want you to keep this date free. Try and keep it free because ticket availability will be limited. And when I mean limited, what we can't go and do is just go and book venues that hold 10,000 people. It's just not feasible. So it will be in its thousand, of course, we will be a minimum of a thousand people. But the point is keep this date free. The date I'm looking at, and I'll confirm the exact venue and all the details in the coming weeks. But the date, because so many have asked you, is Sunday. Yes, it's a Sunday. On this occasion, it's a Sunday. Sunday, 24th of February. The reason it's not in January, because I'm so used to doing conferences and showcases in January, I just thought, you know, we'll give the, kit, the, the get the year going with everything we need to and then do it in February. Let all the other little companies get their showcases out of the way and then we'll hit them with the best one that anybody's ever seen. 24th of February, keep that date free if you possibly can. Ticketing and location, well location will be Central Birmingham and I'll give you the exact location um, in the coming weeks. Um, and of course, ticketing for that. We'll let you know all about that. Um, but that's going to be, in my humble opinion, a phenomenal, amazing event because we have so much to celebrate so much to talk about, so much to tell, tell you, so much to launch. Um, I simply can't wait. I'm already nervous about it and it's months away. I don't know why, but I just am. So keep that date and I'll let you know more details as the weeks come by, but it will be called the Viva MK New Beginnings Showcase. Um, so I look forward to seeing you all there. But that's in February, so we've got plenty of time to wait for that. Um, systems update, I'll update you fully on where we are with systems and what the latest is, as you've, have you see, as you've seen. There's been progress all this week, um, and that's happening on a daily basis. So I will update you today in another email. So please, please keep checking your emails. And you know, if you check your emails, just sometimes even though your team members do get them forward them or ask people to read them because sometimes i'll send an email out and then i'll get a message about a subject or a question and i'll say well have you read your email no i haven't well please go and read your email and that happens so often because the information is all in there so do um watch out for a system update later now i've always said to you that we are the people's business. And by that, I mean it's really for the people. People become, become first before profits or anything else. People are the most important part of our organization. I hope you feel that already. I hope you see that already happening in our inception days that we have stuck to what I always wanted this to be, a people's organization for the people, about the people, and everything to do with the people. And if we concentrate on that, this organization cannot go wrong. I said to you two weeks ago that I will always be transparent with you. You know, when you make a statement like that, 
People do hang you with such statements because then they want to know everything. There's always going to be company sensitivities and commercialities that you can't always discuss, not openly in this arena like this, where it's available to the whole world. But where transparency is concerned, I and nobody here has got any thing to hide. There's no ulterior motives, no nothing. We want to build a business. We want to build a business for the people. We want people engaged. We want people to feel valued. We want people to feel part of something for a change, not just be part of somebody's faceless downline. That's not what this business is about. Faceless teams with faceless downlines, you know, aligning people's pockets of uplines that never speak to them. That's not what I want in this business. What I want is a fully transparent business that every single person feels valued and feels part of something which is far more important than any kind of system that I've ever seen before. What I've tried to do is take the best of everything I've seen in all my a network marketing career and put it into one company. Of course, it doesn't always come about immediately, but it will come about ultimately. Ultimately, what we will grow from our small beginnings is the ultimate network marketing organization, which follows the ethos of what the industry is really supposed to be. And you're thinking, well, what is it really supposed to be? It's supposed to be people, connection, feeling valued, partnership, spirit, and of course, growth. You don't just do it for the fun of it. People want to make money. So if you can encapsulate all that, that's what I believe Viva MK is. All the things that you wished for in other organizations, but didn't get them in their entirety. What we will build here is the ultimate organization that has all of that in it. But most of all, one that doesn't have anything to hide. What is there to hide? What ulterior motive can there be other than all of us sticking together and working this business and making it work? I just need to always go back to those statements of keeping it transparent, keeping it a partnership, you know, keeping it together and keeping us as a unit that represents how the business is supposed to be. I don't care about other businesses. I just want ours to be the best and follow that ethos. Hopefully that's got the point across. So a few weeks ago, I slightly prematurely revealed fam jams. Remember those? Fam jams couldn't get enough of that word, still can't. Um, they're actually now available and all online and all in stock. So if you do make sure that you have a look at vivamkonline.com, vivamkonline.com, you will see the fam jams in all their glorious sizes available. And for those of you that don't know what a fam jam is, it's a selection of identical pajamas for the entire family. So you can sit at home in the warmth of your own home, all dressed the same in Christmas family fam jams. So they're finally with us and it says now online and in stock. Now, people say, well, why can't we have these in catalogs? Because we buy certain things in quick moving, smaller quantities to move them out. What you can't have is redundant stock of thousands of items. So we buy these for quick sale. If something has a phenomenal sale to it, we'll put, we'll put it in flyers and catalogs where we can. So fam jams are available. Last week, I gave you Halloween makeup. Of course, that is also all online now. As I said, vivamkonline.com. Also last week, we launched Little Viva, which was a range for, of course, kids. Um, and that's where the unicorn horn came in that I mentioned earlier, just in case somebody's new to this live and thinking, what on earth is he talking about? What does he mean, unicorn horn? What kind of business presentation is this? So last week we revealed those. Um, that was a little Viva range. It's all live now, so you can have a look at that. Um, and as time goes by, 
I fully intend to, or we fully intend to um, imp improve on that brand. And I think there is, from your feedback so far, there is a huge market for Little Viva. And that was the said horn that many of you gave me a suggestion on what I could do with it. Thank you for that. I appreciate it. Um, but the Little Viva range can only grow. Also, what you'll find already online, already live, already available is a jewellery range, jewellery range that I launched two weeks ago. So, um, again, vivamkonline.com. And here's another example. There's a little doggy and there's a little pussycat. Very, very cute items of jewellery, all available now as we speak. Um, and the great thing is they all come gift wrapped in their little boxes. They're all quite unique. You won't find them everywhere in the world, you know, so they're quite unique. Little doggy, little pussy. I think um, you'll, you'll really appreciate those and so will your customers. Check those out. They're all live as we speak today on um, vivamkonline.com. Do check that because that's where you can take the images from. You can advertise it online wherever you want to. You can even direct people to have a look online and then to give you the order. So do have a look. In respect of new products, I've got one or two things here for you, of course. Um, I'm struggling because they've only just been given to me. Well, I'm always struggling, aren't I? but they've only just been given to me, so I'm gonna to have to try and work out what they are. Now, this is a, well, I don't know what that is, actually. I think um, that is, oh, it's a sock. It's a snuggle sock. I don't know what I'm putting on my hand, but these are snuggle socks, and you'll see these again in the next 24 hours going online. Those are called snuggle socks in black try and say snuggle socks in black then we've got some kind of products you've been asking for i know there's a great demand on the products you're asking for we have had hundreds of suggestions of what we can sell we can't supply them all of course we can't but we'll try and work through those things and the more popular things we requested for we'll try and regularly get so again these may not be the sexiest products in the world, but it's what you and your customers are asking for. So these are like cooker hood filters. Um, again, sorry, I don't, didn't have, a, these have only just been passed to me and these will be going online. If anybody had ever told me years ago that I'd be live talking about cooking hood filters and little pussy and doggy necklaces, I would not have believed them, but world changes and so have we. So those are actually going to be online. I've also got, what in God's name is that? Um, uh, yeah, I, well, I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't really know what that is. Um, oh, yes. Yes, I know. If you have, this is made of silicone. There it is, yes. This is made of silicone. What you do, you put it on the rim of your hot pan and then you pour. It's a pouring spout. This is a silicone pourer in red, believe it or not. I got the red bit right, so it's a silicon pourer. Who is asking for these things? And why have I got to launch them without any descriptions? Anyway, here we go. It's a silicon pourer. Apparently you want them, your customers want them, and people want to buy them, so they'll be online. Uh, I think I've worked out what this is. Again, if anybody had told me I'd be holding up a brush with a scraper on the end of it, I would have laughed them out of the room. That is a brush with a scraper on it. What's it actually called? Oh, a snow ice scraper and brush. Even I can work that out. So that is obviously gonna come in handy. Apparently we are heading, it's certainly better than holding that wand I was holding last week. Apparently we're getting four months of the coldest winter we've had in decades coming our way. So those might just sell. Um, so that's going to be online within the next 24 hours or so. Then we have, oh, here we go. This box says, handle with care, sharp object inside. But that's all it says. So, 
Um, let me see, sharp object inside. Let me just see what this is. I really haven't got any idea what on earth I'm supposed to do with that. No suggestions. I know every time I say, what am I supposed to do with that? I get lots of ideas and recommendations. Um, answers on a postcard. What on earth is that? All it says here, ah, it is a walking stick ice grip. Oh, they must be massively in demand then. A walking stick ice grip, ladies and gentlemen. That, believe it or not, is not a medical instrument, as I first thought I'd been stitched up with. It is a walking stick ice grip. So apparently there's some demand on those. So uh, you know better than I do. Then we have this. It just gets better by the second, doesn't it? This is, and no, I'm not putting it on. This is a microfiber quick dry sarong. God, the demand must be incredible. I can just see you all coming out the bath. Well, you shouldn't, I can't see you all, but I'm trying to imagine coming out the bath, sticking on one of these, getting all dry, putting on your fam jams, then going out to scrape the car whilst pouring from your um, hot pans, cleverly pouring out and trying to work out how the hell that works. Um, whilst having a very clean kitchen because your cooker hoods and of course having extremely warm feet with these snuggle socks. It's all going on whilst, of course, wearing these amazing little necklaces. You see, Viva MK, every day is unpredictable. As unpredictable as this live broadcast. Half the time, I don't know what's going on or what I'm going to say next, but I do know the numbers of people joining us is phenomenal. The recognition is incredible. The spirit is unbelievable. And our future, if we keep working the way we do and connecting the way we do, our future, ladies and gentlemen, is unbelievable. And if you do have a walking stick, you won't slip either. So everything that's going on sometimes may seem random. But there is a strategy and plan behind it. There really is. I know you're thinking, how can there possibly be a strategy from somebody who's just launched two of the most random products ever created by mankind? But there is a strategy. And the strategy is simple, like I've already, already said. Create a business that's taken all the best bits of all the businesses out there and try to create one organization that stands up for the ethos of network marketing being the people's business where every single individual involved feels valued and a part of something. And I tell you, it's got to be one of my ultimate business goals to be able to do that. And all of you are helping do that. I was at a meeting in Scotland on Saturday and thank you for Lynn McDonald for putting that meeting together. The spirit, the atmosphere in that meeting alone was absolutely incredible. You know, of course there's going to be people that are going to have something to complain about, but that's okay because the overall spirit that you created in that meeting was the best I'd seen in absolutely years. Ladies and gentlemen, what we're creating here together is an ultimate goal. And if that means along the way, people make money and feel valued, what is there not to like? Thank you for joining me again. I apologize for not um, having more information on the randomness of the products that I just launched. I mean, really, but hey, that's Viva MK. We make it up as we go along. We do have a strategy, we do have a plan, and the ultimate goal of making this the people's business with no match out there. Thank you for listening and I'll catch you soon, bye.